Hello, today I'm here with a new video and uh, you see me a lot this week because today it's time for the fourth video this week and I'm going to play with Kaleidos, VR Neon, Futurism 4. Futurism 4, VR Neon maybe. And I think this is my favorite palette from Kaleidos. I can never decide. <laughs> but it looks like this and I'm going to do a look with this today. You see now? And I think I'm going to keep this simple as I have done in all of these videos. I think. The three before. So yeah, I'm just going to prime my eyes and then we get started. So I will start actually with the green shade and take it in my like inner crease. And I don't know how this look <laughs> will end up, but we are going to try. I'm taking this and yeah. If you hear her, Astrid, I tried to shut her out, but name it for the four. I tried to shut her out, but like my little mom heart, <laughs> I can't ignore her. So the camera might shake a little bit. But she usually just lie down after a little while. And I really do like this green and I don't know how much I will take in my inner corner. And I also think I will take it like onto my lower lash later as well. But I will do that after I've done my base. And I'm trying to make my videos a little bit shorter, so I am trying to just do like one eye on camera. Oh no, she's laying down. I don't know what you feel about that, but it's just like for my own sake, because I have no idea what I want to talk about. And I love like how crazy for this then i'm actually going in with this red one this one and taking it in the rest of my crease and i will be a little bit careful when i come into the green one so it doesn't like get all muddy or like brownish so i will tap my brush off just to be on the safe side but this is really pigmented I think if I just go in slowly, slowly, <laughs> do the green one, I think it will work. So for my lid, I will go in a little bit with the red and then I will take this orange shimmer on most of my lid. And I know it is a lot of shimmers in this week. But it's just that I want to play with the amazing shimmers. And this red is so freaking good. But I might like... I don't have... This is the fourth video I am doing, so it might not be shimmers. Like in the last three, I don't know. Because I'm not planning these looks, I'm just doing what I feel like. And then I'm taking the orange shade, put it on the rest of my lid. And this has some gold sparks to it, or... I don't know. I don't know uh, what it is with this shade, but... It's a really amazing shade. Maybe I should have cut my crease to have like a sharper edge to the green. What if I just tap this on? Like up here, does that work better than? I think I should have cut it.
but you know what? Welcome to my little not thinking about things makeup channel. Because now this is a really like the shimmer specs get all over. And sometimes I do not mind, but sometimes I might like would want a cut crease. But I just go in with my brush that I had in my crease to maybe take a little bit away and then I'm going in with the red. I like never know about doing this thing. I just not having a good day today. <laughs> no. Like at work today it was like me and my colleagues we just wanted the day to end and we wished that it would be a Friday. Today is um Thursday. Do you have days like that on work that you're like, okay, just, I just want to get off today. It wasn't that much on work, but you know, when everything that can go wrong, does go wrong. It was this kind, this kind of a day and <sighs> sometimes at work I'm like, what the hell am I even doing here? Okay, now I see that I want to go in with the red a little bit more. Like out here, just. Do the eyes look even, Steven? Yes. So, <laughs> take away the fallouts, fix my base. It will probably go like shit because everything... It's just that kind of day, <laughs> so I'll take away the fallouts, fix my base, and then I come back and we do the under eyes. And hopefully it will feel better. I have no idea right now, but hopefully. Time for my under eyes. And I actually think that I will start in my inner corner with the green. And I think I have hair somewhere. I'll start with the green and like drag it under a little bit. Let's we'll see how this goes. And if you wonder how I have been when I've done my base, I've been in a fight with Astrid. She wanted to play with one of the plants. And I didn't want that. Like this, and then I think I will take. Do I want to take the orange, maybe, or the red? I have to visualize it before I do it. I never do this, but I want to. Okay, I think I'm going to take both. So I start with the orange, like closest to here. And then I'm just taking the red one out here. But I like the eye look like this, so I'm just going to do the final touches and then I come back with the finished look. So this is the finished look. For my waterline I used LA Girl Shockwave in Screaming and for my lips I used Ambition that is a lip tonic from Kaleidos and I really like this look. It started off like, okay, I'm liking this. In the middle I was like, mm, maybe not, but now in the end I really do like it. So I hope you like this as well. I think, unfortunately, this palette is discontinued. I can't remember, but I think, I think it's a little bit strange though, because this is number four. And it's strange to take away, like, all except for number four. I don't know if the Electro Turquoise that is coming tomorrow is a limited edition as well. 
I do not remember. But I really like this palette. I think this is my favorite Kaleidos palette. Maybe together with Sci-Fi Green. And if you don't have this, I think you can dupe this. Because it's only six shades. So I am sure that you have something in your collection. The shimmers might be a little bit hard to dupe. But I am not an expert when it comes to single shadows. So I don't know. It might be super easy. But it's so fun to play with this palette. I really like the front of this. And yeah. Now I'm going to stop talking. And I really hope you like this video. And I hope that you are looking forward to the end of this week. I know for some it might be a little bit more boring to the end of the week. Because number 7 is the Sashimi City. And that is more neutral palette I don't know um but yeah I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribed to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and also I am doing a Q&A here on my channel and if you want to ask me something you can ask down in the comments on this video or you can go to my community tab where I have a post where you can ask me questions if it is something you wonder it can be about anything it can be about me, it can be about work, it can be about cats, it can be about whatever you want. So yeah, I really hope you like this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel, please do. I already said that, so now I'm going to say goodbye. So, bye.